Okay, let's discuss politics. Yes. Now, the presidential candidate of the a AAC, Omoye yeah. Showorre, Sh has asked you not to attend the presidential debate. He said, if some candidates like himself have been excluded, you should stand against exclusion because you want to run an inclusive government. I do not know whether or not you've responded to him personally or publicly, but I am sure he's watching. What do you want to tell him? <laughs> well, let me, let me say, first of all, um, that um, my party, the YPP, is pleased and um, gratified that we were selected as one of the five parties uh, to participate in the presidential debates. It is a testament to how hard my candidacy has worked, how far we have gone across this country, and the type of following that we have that that decision was made. That's number one. But, do you, but Number two, I'm laying the foundation. Okay. Number two, we, I have said that I would have liked to see some other candidates who I know have also worked hard in their own ways to have been included, including Shower's party, including people like Tope Faswa, you know, including people like Donald Duke, although they are now having issues in his party. The decision was taken by those who organized the debates. They have explained their criteria. They have made a public statement. Having expressed sympathy for him and some others in a similar position, I don't think the burden should now be placed on me to address the issue. The burden is on those who made the decision. And, and they should take it up with those people, and they have expressed their views. So I don't think it's fair to place me on the stand for having been invited to a debate, because I worked hard 